I'm Nathaniel Paul. And I'm Jillian. Together we are the Bergamot. Welcome to our very first virtual Christmas special. We are so excited to have you here. We have put a lot of hours into this special. And because it is such an unusual year <laughs> with such unusual circumstances, we are excited to bring something to you that we hope can lift your hearts and your spirits for about an hour, hour and 15 minutes, however long it ended up being. <laughs> we're not totally done editing as of this point. So we're super excited to bring it to you and just so glad to be with you guys tonight. Okay, so one of the first things we definitely want to throw out there is what are you eating and what are you drinking? So right now we've got one of our very favorite teas. It is uh, a lavender tea by Yogi. And what are you eating tonight? I'm going to have a couple of these nice cookies. Is it bad? Um, just... um, yes. Oh my God. There you go. It's delicious. But what are you guys having tonight? Let us know in the comments. Should be right over here on the side. Could be on that side, that oh side. Not 100% sure, but let us know in the comments what are you guys drinking. We'll be uh, interacting with you in the comments as well. Those cookies are, you, babe, you have to try them. I'll try and just, I'll just, try and, I'm, I'm going to. nibble. Mmm. <laughs> <laughs> Unbelievable. I love a good Christmas sugar cookie. So, we're here tonight to present to mm. you our performance of the 2019's the Bergamot South Shore Christmas Concert at the Acorn Theater. And what is one of your most, I don't know, favorite moments from the night? Do you oh remember? Oh my God. All right. So this night was really special because it was right in the middle of our first ever Christmas tour that we took it from, oh my gosh, we, we played this show in Nashville up in Northern Michigan. We played it in Three Oaks, Michigan at Acorn Theater, which is what we're about to show you. And we also, uh, we also played it in New York City. So um, a favorite moment from the night, definitely we had an honored guest, Chris Brownlee on saxophone. Every time Chris got up there with that saxophone, I was pretty much in heaven. Yeah, it that was, is, you're it's always see. amazing having a lead player of such high quality as Chris. It was, and, oh, uh, and then there's also our good friends, Jordan Swartz and Druber and Cameron Nagel to round out the night. Uh, the full band presentation, we are super excited to bring it to you guys tonight. Um, Wait, I don't know I have how many you. hundreds of hours have already gone into editing this thing, but uh, you know how it all came together. I'm excited to talk about that, but what was your question? I was gonna ask you two things, um, and then we're gonna wrap into how this did happen. What was your favorite moment of the night? If you have one, it's um, so hard. This is like a really difficult question. My, my, my favorite moment is going to be Chris's solo during Empires. Just the Empire song. Um, we've played it so many times uh, all throughout the country and so many requests have been for a good recording of the song. We've never been able to actually have one. So this song tonight, Empires, will be debuting for the first time ever uh, in Woo! a recorded fashion. And I think Chris really did an amazing job with this solo. And obviously uh, Cameron and Jordan just knocked it out of the park. And it was just Hold a great, down. great song. Um, super excited to bring that one to you guys tonight. And also want to talk about how this whole thing came together. Oh my goodness, yes. So we consider this to be a Christmas miracle because we've never in our wildest dreams imagined putting on a Christmas special. And we never also imagined that COVID would happen. I also want to say we're sitting in front of a very warm fire, so we might be needing to dab <laughs> our brow just a little bit. You're actually, you're, you you've doing? got a nice glow. Okay, good, I think good. I think it's going all right. Let's pick it up from there. Where were you at? Okay, um, okay, so we consider this a Christmas miracle, how this whole Christmas special came together for a few reasons. One, we never imagined that we would not be touring for a year. Uh, that was crazy for us. And then the second thing is, we didn't ever really imagine that we would put on a Christmas special. No, we didn't. And so we had received an email from our good friend, Robert Campbell, who you, shout Robert. out to Robert. Without him, we couldn't have pulled this off, truly. No. Um, and our good friend, Evan. And they let us know that they had all this material uh, because we're all kind of looking to create unique experiences in this quarantine situation that we're in because we were supposed to be playing at the Acorn this year, but we can't. So when we reached out to them, we thought, well, let's just kind of dabble around. Let's get the pieces and see what works and what, uh, what doesn't. But the truth was everything literally came together so perfectly that we were like, I think <laughs> we have enough for a Christmas special. And um, yeah, that's, that's kind of the inner workings of this video, this show that you're about to enjoy. And we got about 30 seconds left. Okay, one really important thing that I was gonna wrap it in before we start this special. We could not have done this without Cameron Nagel, Jordan Swartz and Druber, 
We couldn't have done it without Chris Brownlee on saxophone. We could not have done this production without Evan Margul, Robert Campbell. There's a long list of people, but truly without our sponsors and patrons who stepped up, came forward, said, we want this. We want this Christmas special. And they helped us financially put this together. We love you all. We thank you all. And we are almost to the right. to finish line to start we this night. We are going to send you guys into this concert now. We're super excited to have this cold open. Uh, it's going to be a... A little bit of a twist, so we hope you guys enjoy every moment of this. Um, and also, we'll be uh, we'll be jumping back in in about the middle and at the end to let you know where you can support this cause. It's been a tough year for musicians, as you can imagine, but we're as trying well to do, as the Acorn Theater. As well as the Acorn Theater, it's been tough all around. So we're trying to keep as much positive energy as we can. We want to send you guys much love, ever upwards. Enjoy the show. Shine on, Merry Christmas! You'll see us at the set break. Love you! And definitely gonna have to eat some more of these cookies. <laughs> Ever upwards, friends. Enjoy. Mm.
remember this December I love you my dear I know it's been a long year But let me tell you this Just remember this December Thank you all so much for being here tonight with us. We're just uh, so glad to be back in Three Oaks at the uh, at the Acorn. Such a special place, and uh, and we're ready to to have a good time tonight. So, you guys ready ready for a good time? Gonna get to know you better 
you so much. Hey, what is going on? I love th th this row back here. Hey, shine on. Yes. <laughs> What a joy, seriously. We, we've done something that we've never done this year, and we started it all here. So this is our third annual Christmas concert here in Three Oaks. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> and so last year when we finished the show, we were like, oh my goodness. You know, we put, we put months of preparation into the show, and we we're like, that was so much fun. What if we took the Christmas show that we play in Three Oaks on the road next year? So this is our fourth stop on our Chris first ever Christmas store tour. And um, it wouldn't have happened had we not done it here the first year. So we thank all of you for coming out tonight. Well, we do have a special guest here tonight. Our good friend. Chris Brownlee is going to join us tonight. He is an incredible saxophone player. And we are very lucky to have him on stage with us. Amazing. He'll be back. 
This is the part of the set where I take my heels off. <laughs> Yeah, I um, I don't do much at this part of the set. I just continue to play music. Wait, what do you take off? You don't take off my anything shoes at this on. point? <laughs> Unless, I mean, I could take my shoes off, but I don't know if it would really create any sort of extra energy yeah, in the room. Yeah, maybe we tonight. should just keep those on back there. Yeah, I'm thinking it's not really, uh, it's not really something that uh, people are looking forward to. But how about these sacks? They got some, yeah, that's what I'm talking about, see? Yeah, you saw them. That's what I'm talking about. I'm all about the subtleties. That's what it's about. NP in the back with some Christmas sacks. All right, here we go. very favorite thing to be with you all present on stage looking at your faces singing music together there's nothing better as an artist so we thank you all from the bottom of our hearts for coming out and supporting independent music Chestnuts roasting on an open fire Jack Frost nipping at your nose Yuletide carols being sung By her choir and flows Dressed up like Eskimos Everybody knows a turkey and some mistletoe Helps to make the season right 
tiny tats with their eyes on the go will find it hard to sleep tonight they know that Santa's on his way he's loaded lots of toys and goodies on his sleigh and every mother's child is gonna spy to see if Randy really know how to fly and so I'm offering the simple phrase from kids from one to ninety-two although it's been said Many times, many ways Merry Christmas Merry Christmas Merry Christmas to And so I'm offering this simple phrase from kids from one to ninety-two. Although it's been said many times, many ways. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas, Merry Christmas to you. Thank you. I um, really like singing that song. It's a fun song. We like listening to you. Huh. Hey. Okay. Number one fan. All right. Well, hey, hey all right. Yeah, that's true. <laughs> Gotta wear the heart. So I want to hear some, uh, so did, I want to hear something good that happened this year for somebody. So anybody got something good, just shout it out. What do you got? Growth. Growth. Somebody you got became, married? Wait, hold. You became a veterinarian? <laughs> no, they got married. They got married. Okay, fair enough. Woo woo! To the newlyweds. <laughs> we see you. Congrats. <laughs> Mazel tov. <laughs> Still a lot. No, that's happy birthday in Polish. That's true. <laughs> Sounded good though. We met the yeah, there you go. Oh. Mayfly, Mayfly release. Yeah. yeah, that was a good one. Man, it's crazy to think. Wait, well, I have one good thing that happened to me this year. We had a fan, Kenzie. She listened to our music on Spotify so much that we became, <laughs> I love you, Kenzie. We, we became her band of the decade. How amazing is that? We love you, Kenzie. It is the night of our dear Savior's birth. Long lay the world in sin and death repining till he appeared and the
the soul felt its worth A thrill of hope The weary world rejoices For yonder break A new and glorious morn For can imagine a South Shoreline travel on this song, maybe that's where, where we're going to take you on this one. It's a song called Young Again. We hope you enjoy it. When I was a young boy, I had a vision of dreams that would become for me. My late night adventures, my sweet youth surrender, learning who I'd rather be. Well, I Gave it all that I had well, Life was an ocean and I was captain Set on a journey to sea Cause I always wanted to be older But now that I'm older I wanna be young again Well I wanna be young again Sank in the world that I've been living in. 
Peter washed up there, right on the shore. The world I see, I wanted nothing more than to take the hand of Miss Liberty and dance from last dance, just her and me. We'll make our footsteps on the shore. All I cared was to have one moment. Actually, I'm going to do this. This is something I've never done here at the Acorn. This is something I actually did a week ago. And it was really fun. And so I'm going to do it for you all right now. I'm going to sing something a cappella for you. And this is, this is the type of stuff that actually gets my heart, heart racing. <laughs> um, so I'm going to have Evan give me a little more verb. Is there any way to dim some of these main lights just a little bit, setting the mood up? because we gotta, we got to change it up a little bit for this, I think it would be fun. So this is actually what happens usually behind the sa- stage, but since I'm the manager and I'm a performer, you're actually going to hear it on the stage. <laughs> All right, here we go. This song is a song that, oh, 
It means so much to me. It's a song that, for me, truly represents the spirit of Christmas. And uh, I hope you enjoy it. Ave Maria Made in mild Holy Listen to her For thou canst hear amid the world. Tis thou, tis thou can save amid despair. We slumbered safely till the Thank you so much. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you so much. <laughs> Thank you. We're going to take a quick set break and we'll be back on. Thank you. Shine on. Well, we're back. That was a moving version of the Ave Maria by Jillian. Thank you so much. I, for real though, I was nervous. That was the first time I've ever performed a acapella, but it was exhilarating. So I think I'm gonna need to do that again. Yeah, for sure. Uh, so we ended it with Young Again and Ave Maria. We hope you guys are enjoying the concert. We're officially at the halfway mark and we wanted to let you know that this is the time where you can support stuff videos, productions like these that you're watching and enjoying right now by going to these two websites. You can support us by going to thebergamot.com and click the support tab. Seriously, all the donations and contributions go a long way in helping us as this has been a truly challenging year because everything has been shut off, all venues, all tours. And secondly, please go check out acornlive.org. You can support them by giving them a donation. Their lights on that stage have been off all year long and honestly, it breaks our hearts because we know how much music and theater and these beautiful performances bring so much joy to so many people. So if you are enjoying this tonight, please consider sending a $5 donation. Yeah, it really makes a difference. We will also make sure to include the links below in the description of the video. You can probably find links to those sites as well. And uh, we hope you guys are enjoying the concert. 
Uh, we also have a couple of special thank yous. We wanna send a special thank you out to the people who helped make this, this video possible. Robert Hostetler, uh, the Podell family. We've got Donna Cole. Seriously, girl, you really are our fairy rock mother. Thank you so much for your contribution. You're unbelievable, so generous. We've got the Hoffs, Marianne and Polly G. Jenny Zimmerman, shout out. Uh, of course, the Acorn Theater for partnering up and helping us promote. We couldn't do this without you. Um, the Walls family and uh, Donna uh, Drennan and your beautiful family. Thank you so much for your support. And last but not least, the Gilliam family. We love you all. If you were not listening on here and you supported, know that we deeply appreciate you and your contribution seriously goes a long way. We'll say no more. We want to send you right back to the concert. Hopefully you got a chance to refill your drink, maybe get another serving of whatever it is that you're eating or drinking. Popcorn, Popcorn. cookies. Popcorn. And uh, we hope you guys enjoy. We'll see you at the end. Ever Upwards. Shine on. Forget 
about tomorrow If you want to live today Forget about tomorrow Forget about tomorrow Forget about tomorrow My thoughts can be so relentless You about gave up when I said this But now that I know you're fading Well I had to go but I waited on you If you want to leave today, forget about tomorrow. Nice if you want to leave today, I think we need to separate and see who's got the singers. All right. I'm fair. I'm game for that. I'm pretty confident. I'm looking out. All right. So <laughs> anybody right of this line, you're on team A. And everybody left of this line, you're on team A+. Plus. What? Like didn't see that coming, did you? I didn't see that coming. We weren't going to be Team B. No, I know that. You could team, be team A plus, what's up? You, they could have been. Yeah. Okay. I don't like the jib of their rib over there. So we're going to show them. We don't have to say anything. Quiet confidence. We're going to sing. We're going to sing loud. We're going to sing in harmony together. Here we go. I'm going to warm you up. Forget about tomorrow if you want to live today. Pretty good there. Forget about, bring it up if you want to live as loud as you can go. Here we go. Forget about tomorrow. Want to live. That is good. Forget about if you want to live today. All right, Team go. A+. Plus. It goes job, like this. Everybody. We're going to wait for it. Here we go. Just imagine you're like in an Irish bar late night. You've had too many beers. It's okay. Nobody's going to remember this. Let's do it. Here we go. Oh, the A-plusers, they got the A-plus. There was a, a lot plus. of energy over there. You guys, we need to bring it up. Here we go. Forget about today. Oh, yeah. Forget about. Yeah. If you want to leave today, bring it up, people. Forget about.
I'll open you get the bath tomorrow with our sex player. Come on. Oh, you want to leave today. In the key of C, baby. on the spot there. We've so, never rehearsed that. <laughs> Love it. A true professional. How many people have heard, <laughs> I, tell, I tell this Mayfly story, how many people have heard the Mayfly story before? Oh, okay, it's good. a good so we have a new people. audience. We have a new audience. All right, so <laughs> the Mayfly, how many people know what a Mayfly is? Okay, so many, many people. So we go around the country telling this story and we tell people every time, it's like a secret way of communicating in New York City, Los Angeles, anywhere around the world. We used to say, how many people know what a mayfly is? And if like one person, so this actually happened last time we were in Los Angeles, one person raised their hand. And I was like, you're from the Midwest, aren't you? She's like, South Bend, Indiana. We're I was like, like where did you go to high school? She was like, St. Joe. I was like, what? You're in a show in LA. It was like, and we made this connection. We were talking about it afterwards. We were like, it's our covert way of knowing Who's whether or not Midwest? we have Midwesterners in the house. So this song, Mayflies, Mayflies live for 24 hours. They build a set of wings. They tear those wings apart. They rebuild another set of wings. They procreate and die all within 24 hours. I mean, it's this magical story. And, and if you're from the Midwest, you kind of know they're native to the Midwest region and also the Nile River region. So Aristotle wrote a lot about them. And when I was doing my research on this song, I kind of came across it, and so somebody had asked us how long we've been together, and we always start the story, oh, we've been together for 15 years, we dated for 10, because I was very quick to make a decision that we needed to get married, and then we got married about six years ago. And so instead of saying that, I said, we've been in love for the lives of 3,500 mayflies. And, um, and this girl kind of looked at me like, that's cool, but that's also very strange. And uh, but she was like, like, but you I'm should. very strange. She's like, but you should write a song about it. So they went out on a hike. I got all my craziness going, and I wrote a song called Mayflies. And when we got back, he, there was paper everywhere. His guitar, his hair was all crazy. And we're like, hey, how did it go in here? It's a mess. 
in the yeah, crumple that's of papers. Kind of my life. And he's like, I wrote a song. You guys sit down, listen to this. So, and this is what happened. So basically, this song about the mayfly. So we tell this story everywhere we go. We've learned so much about the mayfly that it's like it's killed in like freshwater sources. But if like if the water is polluted, it dies. It's like the first thing to die. It's just this amazing creature that tells a lot about humanity. And like if you're born on a rainy day as a mayfly, you got a rainy day. You got to make the best of it. You're born on a sunny day. You're born on a cold day. You're born on a hot day. It's just you got to make the most of it, which is a much like life these days. And so I'm telling this story down in Arkansas. And after the show, this guy comes up to me and he's like, hey, man, I'm an entomologist. And I'm like, I don't actually know what an entomologist is. And he's like, I have my PhD in the study of bugs. And he's like, I was like, the mayfly song, right? And I always say there's a saying that like the fish is always, you know, like this big, you know, as the story goes on and on. And he's like, no. He grabbed me by the shoulders and he looked me in the eyes and he's like, you don't understand. Nobody's talking about the plight of the mayfly. <laughs> and I'm like... Yeah, okay. And he's like, what you need to do with this song is go to every bug conference across the entire planet and play this song for bug lovers. And we had this moment where I was like, you're crazy just like me. We're going to do this. You want to go on the road with us? <laughs> but he's like, one thing I have to change about the song. Though. I was like, fair enough. You're an entomologist. I'm just a songwriter. And he's like, I'm going to rename this song the anthem of the mayfly. So we present to you now the song that we've named Mayflies, but as some have lovingly renamed it in parts of southern Arkansas, the anthem of the Mayflies.
Hey, you guys have been a fun crowd tonight. Yeah. That's what I'm talking about. That's the love I need. Got some Mayfly fans out there. This next song is a song called Empires. And um, it's a special song because uh, in, uh, we had a family dog named Eli. And um, he was getting ready to transition into the next life. And he was uh, sitting at my feet. And I thought, man, like the highest honor I can give anybody for anything would be to write a song about it. And so the song, uh, the chorus is, 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 reminds me of like what it's like what I hope life is so complicated and life is strange and, and difficult and hard to understand. Like, like we were saying in the beginning, 2019, we we're like, eh, you know, this is okay. Because things happen. And so the thing is, is that, but really the love of a dog is like, if we could learn to love like dogs every day, like that would just be like the most amazing thing. Like, what if you just saw this person you don't know and you're just like, oh my God, it's you. <laughs> I'm, just, I'm so glad to see you. I mean, it's just, I'm so happy. And they're like, do you know me? It's like, no, but I could just tell. And <laughs> so this song is all about that love that, um, you know, we build these empires in our minds and make things complicated. But really, at the end of the day, life is not that complicated because no matter who you are or where it is you're from, no matter whether you run or what you're running from, all we need and all we want is just to know that we're not alone. And... Uh, my, uh, my good pal Eli sat uh, next to my feet as uh, he made his transition over the next couple days to the next world. And so this thing lives on as like a little memory piece for me and for us out on the road and hopefully for you as well. And uh, it's a song called Empires. No, I'm not worthless But damn, I'm not perfect Just living up to these empires in my mind And in that instance I discovered the difference From living and just staying alive But I feel like I've known it the whole time I'm flying down 94 I'm picking up some time 30 miles east of the state line And then there's Michigan But no matter what state I'm in it's always just a state of mind But I feel like I've known this the whole time Cause I don't care who you are Or where it is you're from Whether or not you run Or what you're running from And all we need And all we want Is to know
and we're not alone No, oh, 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 oh. we're not alone No, oh, 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 oh,
so much. Shine on. Merry Christmas. realize that today? <laughs> I'm not going to do anything more than that. That's all I got for that. But I wanted to at least acknowledge it. So this last song is a song called, um, well, actually, it's a brand new song. We just started playing it on this leg of the tour. And um, we're super excited because we're always playing new stuff. But this is, um, this is a song that, uh, that I want to dedicate actually to my dad tonight. Um, it's a song that... Um, Dad doesn't say much about, he's the toughest critic, and that's why I think I've been blessed in life to be, to be, to be his son. And, the, uh, and this song is a song um, that he heard that he didn't even know that was ours, and he was like, hey, what's, what's the name of that song? And I was like, um, we haven't really named it yet, and he was like, that's, it's a good song. So, um, so we play it for you tonight. We're going to close out the night with it, and um, this goes out to you. He's the man. You were made to run 
So I know you will, you will, and you were made from the sun. In its light, be still, be still, and all your fears, wash them away. And if you're still listening, here's what I'd say, yeah, yeah. A heart doesn't know how to fight. We just teach it. We are right. A heart doesn't know black and white. We just can't see it from the other side. We just can't see it from the other side. Hardships come your way. If you find you are weak, know that is when the heart will speak. And all your fears, wash them away. And if you're still listening, here's what I Doesn't know how to fight. We just teach it. We arrive. A heart doesn't know black and white. We just can't see it from the other side. We just can't see it from the other side.
you guys all so much tonight. It was such a wonderful evening. We hope you had a great time. <laughs> Well, that's a wrap. Thank you so much for joining us for our first ever virtual Christmas special. It has been an unusual 2020 for sure, and not the season that we had hoped for coming into this Christmas season, but we hope that this moment that we were able to create a little bit of light, a little bit of love, and send it your way because you guys have been some of the most amazingly supportive fans over the last eight months as we have been reeling from what has been happening with COVID and things at large in 2020, but uh, wanted to send you guys a little bit of love right now. We're we're so deeply grateful for every single one of you. I hope you can feel the love pouring out of us into your hearts, into your homes. And of course, we're wishing you a very Merry Christmas, Happy Hanukkah, Happy Kwanzaa, all of the things. Um, and just a very special thank you to our families for their support uh, during this time, to the Fliegers, to uh, Don and Inga. Seriously, just we could have done these last few months without you and another special shout out to donna cole our fairy rock mother thank you so much for being our main underwriter for this as well as all of our other patrons and sponsors and if you are feeling generous where can they you can head over to the bergamot.com or acornlive.org those links will be in the in the information below this video and we also want to say that we are heading over to the acorn facebook page to do a q a a live q a so you can join us there right now after this video ends and uh ask whatever's on your mind we just want to continue this hangout this uh digital evening that we're having with you and you can join us on the acorns facebook live page maybe we'll even play you a song or two hey, over there who knows we'll see how feisty we get but cheers to you cheers to 2021 blessings health and abundance shine on Ever we'll upwards. see you over there thanks Bye. for joining us